Warning, this podcast contains strong, offensive, and misogynistic language that some listeners may find offensive. The name's Vert. Personal, original Vert. And I run the P. Vert Detective Agency. The year is 2055, and the police have been defunded. So if you need a police investigation, the cops will charge you a thousand big ones a day. Because of this, the government introduced the P.I. Act, where the private investigators can undercut the police so justice can become affordable. These are my case files. Hi there, are you the manager of the restaurants? Yeah, I'm the manager of the restaurant. What can I do for you? Well, my name is Horny. Hey, Horny. <laughs> That's a bit of an interesting name. Yeah, well, don't, don't. You uh, hide my, you hide my uh, fiance. I've hired a lot of people. Who's your fiance? The uh, gum shoe that got shot yesterday. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, well, uh, what do you want to know? We want to see the CCTV footage. Ask you any information you know. Well, um, let's see. Well, all I know is that this piece of shit was uh, robbing people and you, and it was your fiance. Yeah, my fiance. It was your fiance's turn and, um, he put up a bit of a fight, and he got shot. Right, okay, can we see the CCTV though, please? Yeah, 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 sure, sure. Wow. The fuck is wrong with you? And, um, what do you mean by that? Well, um, you're not exactly human, you know. No, I am not human. I'm from the Retanian Empire. And the Retanian Empire is situated in the Retanian Nebula. Wow, that's interesting because I, I love astronomy and uh, I've never heard of that before. Yes, well, it's at the far side of the galaxy. Wow, that's a long distance you came from. Yes, well, we, my uh, people have um, some very sophisticated hyperdrive technology, which uh, allows us to get from point A to point B very, very quickly. We go through a uh, massive circle with lots of symbols. What, like a, like a Stargate? I've seen that show. The Tolkien shit. No, 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 no. It's like um, four symbols on there. It's just like uh, a brand. Okay, interesting. So you're from the Retanian Empire? Yes, I'm from the Retanian Empire. Okay, okay. Well, well I'll jot that down. I'll tell you what. Um, once you've had a look at the CCTV footage, can you show me the star cluster that I can have a look at to, with my telescope? Yes, yes. All in good time, sir. All in good time. So, yes, yes. Sorry, sorry, people. Um, come this way. Computer, can you um, bring up the CCTV footage from the incident yesterday at 3pm? Uh, Walking. There you go, people. Well, I'll tell you what, I'll leave you to it, and um, I'm just going to go and manage my restaurant, okay? Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, well, um, thank you very much, mate, and um, hopefully we'll be able to get the person that shot my dad. He's your dad, is he? Yeah, and what makes you think he wouldn't be? You're a different colour, by the way. I may be grey, yeah, but if that's my mum, and he was my dad, my mom is the same colour as me, then that makes me their child. Very weird, very weird. I've never seen a family so interesting like this before. And um, what do you mean by that? Are you like a racist or something? No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not racist. Well, I'm not related to the Vert family. I am here on work experience from the Retanian Empire. Okay, well, um, little bastard, do you want to do the honours? Yeah, Ma. No worries. No worries. Okay, right. So, there's the footage. There's Dad the, over there. Just looking at him. Just out looking at that fountain. Yeah. 
he had a real shit day at that, I guarantee. It would have been a nice learner for him. Yeah, I know, I know. There he is. There's our shooter. How do you know it's him? Because he is going around from table to table trying to rob people and they are giving him wallets and money and jewellery. Ah, yeah, okay. Okay, right, let's quickly spin this on. <laughs> There it is, there it is. Right. There he is, and he's arguing with Dad. Hey Mara, you might not want to watch this next bit. Look, don't worry about that, just, um, just hit play. We all know what the end result is anyways. Okay Mara, I, I just, last chance, are you sure you want to see this? It's not going to look good that Dad got shot, yeah. Look, don't worry about that. Just uh, hit play. Yeah, there we go. So he's so he's taking Percival's money and done a runner. There's that pensioner who's just stolen his gun and his bracelet, and she's run off. Wow, watching a pensioner run off like that. Yes, I know it's um. Unheard of. You'd expect her to crack a hip or something. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah. And she bumps into the shooter and he's just mugged her. So he's actually got the bracelet then. Okay then. Okay, right. So uh, let's all go back to the office, yeah? Why not go straight to him? Because I want to get a few bits and bobs before we go to get him. We know where he is. Yeah, I want to just see if the bracelet's at, if he's actually wearing the bracelet or not, and if he is, it's gonna be fun time. Do you understand me, Ratty? Yes. Okay. Yes, I get you on that one. Okay, let's go back to the office. Right. I'm just gonna go and quickly uh, tap onto the computer, see what's going on. Okay, right, so computer has detected a biometric signature that's not Dad's, okay? So he, it's being worn. And I don't think he knows what it is because there is no transporter log on there. He's not used it one bit. Right then, so I guess we should arm up. Ready? Um, I want to make this person pay. I'm going to take a baseball bat. Ma! You wanna baseball bat him? Yeah, uh, yeah. Um, I used to do stuff like this with um, Alexa uh, before I met your father. Really, Ma? You and Alexa used to go around baseball batting people up. Well, some of the, some of the time, uh, sometimes I'd uh, stab people. <laughs> Off, Ma. <laughs> Fuck off, No chance. No chance. Well, it, you can believe me or not, it doesn't matter. I'm still taking a baseball bat. And, um, guys, I think you should uh, arm up with the guns. Okay. Okay, Ma. Okay. Right, let's get there together, yeah? <laughs> Where have you come from? Where have you come from? Hey there. Okay, so we came out of thin air and you're wearing something that doesn't belong to you. Nothing, nothing I have is belongs to me. Nothing, nothing, nothing at all. Nothing at all. Right, well, your bracelet belongs to our family, so take it off. You're not getting anything from me. You're not getting anything from me. Ma, can I? Go ahead, little bastard. <laughs> you, you shot me in the leg. You shot my fiance. I, I, I didn't. I, I, I didn't shoot anyone. Well, that makes you a liar because we got the CCTV footage to show that you did, and you just said that that everything you have uh, isn't yours. So you quite clearly are the person who shot that shot my Percival. 
and we're here to avenge him. He got... He's a gumshoe. I remember him saying... Yes, yes, I remember him saying that he was a gumshoe. Which means he has to follow the law. <laughs> oh. Hey, Raddy. She thinks that... He thinks that my dad followed the law as a gumshoe. Yes, I... Yes, yes, I know. It is quite a humorous thing to do because going by what uh, Percival does, yes, he is a very law-abiding citizen, isn't he? Is he not? <laughs> Ma, do you want this piece of shit? I should. Do you want me to just uh, give him a few uh, goes over first? You can give him a few goes over first. Ah, oh, with pleasure, Ma. With pleasure. <laughs> Oh, oh, damn, no, we did. Oh, damn. 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 I feel a little bit better. Hmm. What do you? What about you, Ma? Well, um. Here, pass me the backpack. Yeah, here you go, Ma. So, you whimpering little bastard. You shot my fiance three times. So I owe you this. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> and and I owe you this. Ah, shit! Oh no, Mark! <laughs> please don't hurt me, though. Please, please. And I owe you this. Ah! Oh, shit! That's my. That's my help. <laughs> you left my fiance for dead. You shot him. And you left him for dead. What do we do with him, boys? Well, we did swear that we would avenge Percival for this. Yeah, Ma. Yeah. It's up to you. Do you want to take him alive? Or shall we make him disappear? <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean? Make me disappear? <laughs> what do you mean? Well... Ready? Are you up for eating this? Mm, I don't like the look of him. I suppose I could do it though. What do you reckon, Horny? Yeah, yeah. You could make him disappear. Um, how long would you need? Would you need a break in between or would you want us to set up the dinner table for you? <laughs> Are you doing? Please don't. Please. Please don't, no. please, please don't, don't, please, please don't do that to me, please don't. Mm. Well, I'll think about it. I am starting to feel a bit peckish though. Oh, it looks like you've got something uh, on the oven as it is. What are you cooking? <laughs> Boiling some water. You're boiling some water, are you? <laughs> yeah, please, please die. Please die. Do anything to me. What do you reckon there, little bastard? Shall we go and do something with this hot water that's being boiled? Yeah, yeah, I like that idea. I like that idea a lot. Yes, yeah, so what, what do you reckon, Horny? Yeah, yeah, I think you should. I think you should. Yes, I do like my food a little bit warmer than cold, to be honest. Please, please, don't. 
I don't think he suffered enough boys because our Percival he he went through a lot of suffering before he got to hospital and you got this whimpering piece of shit he is only sorry because he got caught by us hey Ma do you want to like transport home and we'll just deal with the rest of this I don't think you you uh, might want to be around here for this bit yeah I, I think you're right I think you're right oh just before I leave um, how about this <laughs> so Rally, um, do you want to do the next one? Mm, yes, okay then. Right, I'm going to see what he tastes like. <laughs> please, please don't. <laughs> my hand. You just see it in my hand. <sighs> he needs a bit more salt, to be honest. A bit more salt. Yes. Um. Don't know. I think it might just be the uh, dirt on him. He does taste a bit unwashed. Holy shit, Rally. <laughs> You're for real. Yes, yes, I am for real. <laughs> Just let me go. No. 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 You shot my dad and you left him to die. And, um, you know what? Fuck it. Oh shit, you little bastard. You've got brains all over my trousers. Well, that's not going to dry clean. And Percival will be really annoyed. Oh, shut up, Ratty. It's not as if Dad will be able to wear those again anyways. And uh, why is that? Well, there's a hole in the back where your tail comes out. And if Dad wore that, everyone will see his asshole. That is a good point. Right. Can you have a hunt around and get some ketchup for me? This is going to be a nice little meal. Yeah, no way. Thank you for listening to Gumshoe. Percival Vert will be back next week. If you've liked today's episode, why not like, subscribe and share to all your friends on your social media feeds. Additionally, why not check out our website, which is www.musterxmedia.info. Then you'll be linked up to all of our Master X Media podcasts, as well as other content such as books and our other YouTube channel. So why not check that out? is www.musterxmedia.info and personal vote will catch you next time bye for now